<laughs> Why is too much salt bad for us? Eating lots of salty foods can raise our blood pressure, which isn't healthy for our hearts. It can also make our kidneys work too hard and even weaken our bones. Our bodies need a little salt to stay healthy, not too much. Experts say we should have less than a teaspoon a day. Eating fresh fruits, veggies, and home-cooked meals instead of salty snacks helps keep us strong and feeling great. Mm. Why do we get dehydrated? Dehydration occurs when our body loses more water than it takes in, causing an imbalance. When we are sweating a lot during physical activity or dealing with fever, our body expels more water than usual. If fluids aren't replaced in time, dehydration sets in. This affects the body's ability to regulate temperature, transport nutrients, and remove waste. As a result, we may feel dizzy, tired, or experience dry mouth. Why do we sleep? We sleep because our bodies and brains need time to rest, recover, and recharge. During sleep, the brain processes memories, repairs cells, and releases hormones that help growth and healing. Sleep also strengthens the immune system, keeping us healthy. Without enough sleep, we feel tired, forgetful, and less focused. Our internal clock, circadian rhythm, tells us when to sleep and wake up. Good sleep improves mood, energy, and overall health. Why do we get hiccups? Hiccups happen when the diaphragm, the muscle helping us breathe, suddenly contracts. This makes the vocal cords close quickly, causing the hic sound. Common triggers include eating too fast, drinking carbonated drinks, swallowing air, stress, or sudden temperature changes. Hiccups usually go away on their own after a few minutes, but holding your breath, drinking water, or swallowing sugar can help stop them. Hmm. In rare cases, persistent hiccups may be a sign of a medical issue. Hmm. How do we puke? Simple, like this. Oh, um, some. Puking or vomiting is generally controlled by a part of the brain called area postrema. Now, when it instructs our stomach to purge, several things happen in our body. Firstly, huh? our teeth get coated with excess saliva to protect them from stomach acid. Our heart rate and breathing increases as we retch. Finally, the stomach and other abdominal muscles forcefully push the contents upwards and we puke. Hmm. Does it rain diamonds on Jupiter and Saturn? Yippee! Omsum is all set to go to Jupiter and Saturn. Oh, Omsum. Scientists believe that it can actually rain diamonds on Jupiter and Saturn. Hmm. These planets have methane-rich atmospheres. During storms, lightning turns methane present in clouds into soot. As soot begins to fall, it is subjected to intense temperatures and pressures. These conditions squeeze the soot huh? into chunks of graphite. As the pressure increases, graphite is compressed, making it literally rain diamonds. Hmm. What is sleep huh? paralysis? No big deal. Omsum is always in a sleep paralysis. Oh, Omsum. Sleep paralysis usually occurs when we are dreaming in a REM sleep, as in rapid eye movement sleep. Researchers suggest that when we enter REM sleep, two chemicals, as in GABA and glycine, switch off the activity of our cells. This is done to stop us from enacting our dreams and getting hurt. Now, if we suddenly wake up during the REM sleep, but if GABA and glycine are still active, then even though we are conscious, we are temporarily unable to move. This is called as sleep paralysis. Hmm. Why do we dream? We don't dream. Our brain dreams. Oh, awesome. One theory suggests that we dream to fulfill our wishes. It states that we are not able to express all our thoughts consciously. Hence, some of them find their way via dreams. Another theory called threat stimulation suggests that dreams are basically a defense mechanism. 
For example, nightmares put us in threatening situations, thus allowing us to practice our fight-or-flight response. Some people also believe that dreams don't really mean anything. Hmm. 